I don't know what's going on guys. Come back to another video. Um, I'm gonna, we're gonna be breaking in my glove and yours if you wanna get it broken in. Okay, so here we go. You're gonna need a weight or a softball or a mallet and a baseball. Okay, so this is a hinge right, right here. But right here, so I close it like that, like that, and then you pound away, probably about like right here, and then you smack away at it, move it back and forth. I promise you this is going to help a lot with it, so yeah. It's gonna make the glove get broken in way more than just playing catch. So, and you just need to smack away that as hard as you can. I'm just going lightly right now. So, no. do your thing. And credit to Ball Glove King. Credit to Ball, Ball Glove King because he got in this. Keep on smack no way in it. At 30 minutes. My other breath. There you go. Come on. Okay. It's gonna be off video. I'm gonna be like, you know, I'm gonna be smacking one more. Mm. The progress. Pretty good. So, and also you need to do the, the pinky hinge too, which I call it. So it's basically where you close your glove with the pinky and then hold it. Okay, I'm gonna need to take my blister thing off. And just smack away about right here, all that right here and just move up and down. And do not break your fingers, cause you're gonna get it. Uh, real bad. It'll be out for the season. It's off or oh, oh, baseball. If you break your finger. Just keep on smacking away at it. About a minute so, so. I promise you it's gonna be way loose. It's gonna be way looser than before. Okay, see the progress now. Yeah, it's good. So take your baseball and just for my pocket, your pocket should be about right here, about right here. And for all, and for all infielders, you should have two pockets. So, one right here, and one right here, right here, and right here. And just form it by pounding it. That's so how you guys are. I'm trying my best to show you guys how I wish I had a camera. But I'm just using my iPhone right now, so. About right here. Let's see if you guys can see. Right here. And right here. For like ground balls and stuff, your regular pocket is going to be not in the web. Do never go in the web because it's, it's going to fall out easily. So go right about here under the stitching. So, and then just pound the way at it to form a pocket.
and when you're done with that, right here, about right here, you want to do this to get it lo loosened up until you start cramping up and or until you get until you get tired. So it's probably gonna be for me like five minutes. So it's gonna be like so this is gonna be like at least twenty minutes long. I don't know. Yeah. I'm filming this on my iPhone. This hurts. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna be done right here because. Yeah. And I like to cool my thing. I like to cool her. I did, uh, I'm, I'm just not gonna say it because I figure I'm gonna get made fun of in the comments. So, and then I really forgot. Um, and you just get what, and you just get to work with the glove. Also, and then shape it. You can do the hot wire treatment and give a stretch on the laces. If they break, then that means it, the laces are not in good condition. There you go. And if you want to put your glove inside out, which I'm not going to do right now because I've already done that millions of times, that might hurt your glove if you do it a lot. And if you want your web to be a little not stiff, you can do this and do that. Which I'm, I'm not going to do a lot because, you know, I'm not trying to... Put my glove or anything. Then that's probably gonna be it. Maybe. No, 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 I need to oil my glove up. Also, condition your glove. And you 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 can use oil, that's all I have right now. Which I'm gonna get and I'm gonna get my This is not gonna be edited, so be honest, I'm gonna be back in probably like one minute. Look at my glove when I'm gone. I don't know how to do this, but there we go.
Okay. Okay, I'm back now. Alright, so you can use a toothbrush, anything, but just make sure you wet it down before you do anything. To wash this off, why is it soaping? Hold up. I'm gonna need to wash this off more. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. Guys, I'm back. I'm sorry for the long wait. I can't edit, so put it down, put it down. Always what? Okay. And I'm gonna use my conditioner. Oh, here it come. I wait. I have like no good conditioner left, so I'm just gonna use it on scuff marks and stuff. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys, for the long wait. I used to have a lot of good stuff, so... I'm sorry I don't have the conditioning, but... Okay, that's the end of the video. Bye!